गुड मॉर्निंग एवरी वन माई नेम इज़ सूरज कुमार झा एंड आई एम एक्साइटेड टू प्रजेंट माई मशीन लर्निंग इंटर्नशिप प्रोजेक्ट ऑन एक्सप्लोरिंग डिस्टेंस मैट्रिक्स इन के एन एन वेर के एन एन स्टैंड फॉर के नियरेस्ट नेबर्स टूडे आई एल बी शेयरिंग इन साइट्स इन टू द इम्पोर्टेंस ऑफ डिस्टेंस मैट्रिक्स इन द के नियरेस्ट नेबर्स एल्गोरिजम एंड हाउ दे इम्पैक्ट द इफेक्टिवनेस ऑफ मशीन लर्निंग मॉडल्स so this is my topic measuring proximity exploring distance matrix in knn now application in knn knn algorithm is a supervised learning algorithm which is used for both classification and regression task it determines the class or value of a new data points based on the majority class or average value of its k nearest neighbors the role of distance matrix There are three distance metrics in KNN: Euclidean distance, Manhattan distance, and Minkowski distance. In Euclidean distance, which is best suited for data where the distance in feature space is meaningful and scales are similar, while Manhattan distance is preferred for high-dimensional data or when feature scales differ significantly. Minkowski distance is a versatile distance allowing adjustment adjustment between Euclidean and Manhattan distance by varying p. Now, distance matrix in KNN. So, first one is Euclidean distance, and this is the formula of Euclidean distance, where d is the distance, p and q are two data points, which is square root of summation of p i. Minus q i the whole square, and this is two data points, individual data points of both p and q. A description of Euclidean distance. It measures the straight line distance between two points in Euclidean space. It is sensitive to the scale of the data, and commonly used when the feature scales are similar and differences in magnitude are important. This is an example where I've taken two data points, p and q. Where p is one, two, three, and q is four, six, eight. So this is the distance, square root of individual dis difference between individual data points of both p and q. Then this is the distance which we have getting Euclidean distance. Now man had a distance, which is also called L one for norm. or taxi cab distance this is the formula for manhattan distance which is the summation of n i equal to 1 and individual data point of pi minus qi now description of manhattan distance it measures the distance between two points by summing the absolute differences of their coordinates it is less sensitive to outliers as compared to euclidean distance and suitable for higher dimensional data now this is an example for manhattan distance where this is also similar as two data points which i have taken in euclidean distance now difference between each data points and this is the result to well minkowski distance this is the formula for minkowski distance you have also taken two data points and this is the p p value which we determine in minkowski distance so the description of minkowski distance is that it is generalization of both euclidean and manhattan distance so when p is 1 it becomes manhattan distance when p is 2 it becomes euclidean distance provides flexibility to adjust the matrix according to the value of p This is the value p. Now here I have also taken two examples similar as above. P is one, two, three, and Q is four, six, eight. Two data points, but here we also add p value, which is called you can say a power p equal to three. So uh, this is the distance formula. It is similar as Manhattan distance, but here we Also add the value of p, which we have taken three. 
this is the distance we get in Minkowski distance so measuring simil similarity between two data points in the feature space where feature space is the multi-dimensional space where each dimension represents a feature of the data points so even uh, the distance is smaller which indicates higher similarity between data points and when the distance is larger indicates lower similarity between data points now this is an example which i have taken in python using quotes so we have to import numpy uh, which helps in squaring the value so i have taken three functions for first one is for euclidean distance i have taken two points this is the formula for euclidean distance manhattan distance this is the formula for Manhattan distance and this is Mikowski distance here we have taken an extra parameter which is p-value now two data points which I have taken earlier now I have used the formula and this is the data points or this is the distance which we have gotten in three different k and n distance so, the conclusion is that the Euclidean distance between the points is approximately 7.7 .7 unit, magnetic distance is 12 unit, and Mikowski distance is uh, approximately 6 unit when we've taken p equal to 3. So the results here suggest that the points are relatively close to each other in two distance, Euclidean distance and Mikowski distance while Manhattan distance indicate a larger separation as you can see its distance is very high it's 12 units so we can say in conclusion uh, we understand and select the appropriate distance metric and it is important and crucial for optimizing the performance of k and n algorithms and by exploring different metrics we can enhance the accuracy and efficiency of our machine learning Thank you all for your attention. Thank you.